Looking at something? Yeah, I'm looking at my letter. Oh, go ahead. Sorry. Uh, welcome back to Fun Facts About the Saints, everybody. I hope everyone is doing well. I hope you enjoyed that other video yesterday with Saints Peter and Paul. Oh, yeah, we loved that up here. We were checking it out. I was talking to Peter and Paul. They loved it. Awesome. They loved the appearance, yep. Well, so today, um, so we remember the first martyrs of the Church of Rome, okay? Um, back in the first century, right? Yeah. Yeah, back in the first century. So, uh, anyway, um, today, we have Pope St. Clement the First. Thank you for joining us. You're welcome. I wasn't, uh, um... The reason I'm here instead of the first martyrs of the Church of Rome is because if there's so many of them, we couldn't fit them all on. Uh -huh. That'd be kind of tough. So I'm here to talk about them. Uh, and uh, in fact, not just talk about them, but mm -hmm. give witness to them because, well, I'll tell you in a minute. Okay. So anyway, first a bit about myself. Uh -huh. um, I'm Pope Clement uh -huh. the first. And um, I happen to be... Um, I was evangelized by Peter and Paul, and uh, the first pope uh, consecrated me a bishop. And uh, eventually, um, I became uh, pope myself. Mm. I was the third pope after um, St. Peter. The first there was Linus, Pope Linus, and then there was Pope um, Cletus mm. after Peter, and then there was me. Linus, and then Cletus, yeah, and then there was me. Mm. And I died around the around the word 90, I, um, I became Pope, and then I died in around the year 100. But during my, uh, what, about nine years as Pope, right? Mm -hmm. um, my feast doesn't come until November, but I'm here to talk about the first martyrs of Rome, mm. because I wrote about them, one of the... Uh, there were a lot of writings, you know, when the, when the New Testament writings, St. Paul and St. John and the Gospels, when they were circulating, mm -hmm. there were a lot of other writings that were circulating in the early church. Not all of them got into your New Testament, mm -hmm. into what you call your Bible now. Okay. Um, and, uh, but still, those writings of the early church were still very important for us to understand what the early church was like. And one of those early church writings was my letter to the uh, Corinthians. So you remember that St. Paul wrote a couple letters to the Corinthians that are in the New Testament. Uh-huh. But I wrote the letter to the Corinthians from Pope Clement the First, right? And mm -hmm. in my letter, uh, so first century letter, uh -huh. testimony, I'm Pope, and I'm writing this letter to the church. In that letter, I have it right here, uh, I, in that letter, I give testimony to the first Roman martyrs. Mm -hmm. Um and I talk about how uh, all these people that were trying to live lives of holiness were persecuted during the reign of uh, Emperor Nero. Mm. And, you know, Peter and Paul and, and the other Roman martyrs were all killed. So I gave testimony, I gave witness to the, the saints who uh, we, uh, we commemorate today, the first Roman martyrs. Mm. And they were like, in a sense, the our elder brothers and sisters in the church because they were some of the first martyrs. Um, they were among the first martyrs for the the faith for the in in the church. They were, mm. they were um, they gave their lives, you know, in the circus in the um, in in Rome, mm. uh, just because they were followers of Jesus. So. Um, and it's just, I won't go into details, you know, animals tearing them apart and burning them and everything like that. Emperor Nero did not like Christians, that's for sure. Ooh. Uh, but, uh, but they, you know, once they were martyred, they immediately went to heaven and they've been praying for us ever since. So wow. that's the martyrs of the Church of Rome and we admire their courage and their fidelity. Mm -hmm. um, and we ask uh, for their prayers. So. Why don't we say it? Any questions for me? Um, yeah, cruelty and injustice. Yeah, we don't have to go into detail. Okay. It's pretty nasty. So, you know, why don't we go into the prayer? Uh, sounds good. Okay. <clears throat> do you like do you like my... Uh... <laughs> no. <laughs> I just... <laughs> this... 
special stalls just back from the cleaners, the <laughs> heavenly cleaners. Anyway, go ahead. <laughs> I'm sorry to, to interrupt. We need to say the prayer. <laughs> go ahead. ahead. <clears throat> Father, Son, Holy Spirit, man. Amen. God, you consecrated the co- copious, copious, for, copious first fruits of the Roman Church with with the, with the blood of martyrs, and that we may be strengthened and reduced by the agony of such a struggle, and always rejoice in the victory. Amen. Amen. For first martyrs of church, uh, for the first saint martyr, the first martyrs pray for us. Pray for us. Amen. Amen. And then you can say, and also, Pope Saint Clement. Also, um, Pope Saint Clement the first, pray for us. I will. Come, um, I hope to be back on. Well, in fact, you'll probably just use. Anyway, so I'll see you again in November when my feast day rolls around. So, awesome. All right. All right. Any announcements? Uh, yes. Um, yes. I'm heading over to the cafeteria for a little. What's for dinner? Feast day cheat treat. A treat. What are you getting for a treat? Well, first Roman martyrs. I thought, man, don't I have some pizza, maybe some spaghetti. Okay, well, have at it. And spumoni for dessert. Oh, great. Um, um, as usual, Friday, you'll... Uh, oh, wait, no, today's Wednesday. Um, if there's a, a, a feast, or if there's going to be an uh, interview tomorrow, we'll probably have that. If not, reflection. Um... That day. Um, also, uh, don't forget um, Saint Trivia on Fridays, along with um, the readings for the weekend um, preview on Friday. Um, so be sure to join for that after the following reflection. And also on this weekend is the. Fr- this weekend on Sunday is the Fourth of July. I'm sure you guys have a bunch of plans, um, and I hope um, you guys have a great Fourth of July. Anyway, so thank you all for watching this video. I'll see you next time here on Fun Facts for the Saints. God bless you all.